Your secrets are safe with me. I will keep your secret. So take a picture and page me your diary. No va a cuadrar a bailar con él. Which area está acá, bro? Which area está about a bro? Hey, loco girl. Which area está about a bro? Cause that boy know which year. Hey, Jamaican girls. I realize there's a worldwide thing I go on, but I saw women I like. A lot of us grow up without it. And it causes a big problem within the youths of today and the youths them of before. What I'm really talking about is a thing called self esteem. I know that a lot of you women and men struggle with a low self-esteem and it make you feel out of place up to the day yeah. some of you are 40 at now some of you are 30 at now and you still struggle with low self-esteem and it is very sad so i really come on the internet for come talk about the self-esteem thing because i realize it's a big problem to a lot of people and it happened to females mostly because most of the time males don't really show that they have a low self-esteem but it show within the females and um many times samantha big up many times a woman is with a man she really don't want him you know but you feel like she can't do better because him do good by her by financially helping her out him abuse her in many ways physically mentally spiritually see so she feels so dependent on him by asking him for things every time and this man always use the things them which she asks him for against her that is why i always love a girl who is self-reliant and when i say self-reliant she rely on herself you know we upon a guy to buy soap for wash her front seeing many of our mothers has been through that my mother was a woman we always love and she love and she love hard but i've never seen my mother sit and wait on a man for do nothing for her from i know my mother my mother has always been working she don't depend on no man at all so one of my main reasons why i come on live right now is for to give you a little information and tell you say you have to learn to stand by your own two foot don't feel like say because a guy financially up there he more than you nobody at all no more than you nobody they might have more money than you but remember you was living before this person come they might have made life a little bit easier for you but do remember where you're coming from always learn to stand on your own two feet push your back against the wall and be who you want to be don't try to be where somebody want you to be see this is affecting a lot of the youth them today 
especially the females them because when a guy come and flash a little cash around them feel like say you me need to do this to that guy or me need to do this for that go that guy you like me or that guy I'm nice most time when you hear a girl say a man nice you know why you think you say I'm nice because him do like a good deeds financially most of the times you know see I'm not man don't want no woman with financially stable like the real man them we want a woman with financially stable but some guy used to a woman with like tonight or friday night some guys used to a girl i call them and i say wow well, you can't buy me a little caesar pizza you can't buy me a burger you can't buy me a kfc you know you can't buy me a piece of jerk chicken like this is a ritual every friday so you call this the fried friday ritual You understand? And I hear it, I see, see it go on. I nearly fall into that trap, but I learn, you know, and grow up to know, say, I don't want a woman who is fully dependent on me. Because, you know, sometimes a man always feel like he has to be the breadwinner and the provider at all times. But some woman become the provider and the man becomes the guy who sit down and just be the dependent one. They call them guys some big umpy scumpy. Zine, and these are things when I sit down and like a regular me sit down and me analyze things, you know. And me analyze, you know, and me, me do my little meditation and me see it. Some man have him pocket full of money. Him take it out just to impress a girl, like you know. Him a pay for something. And him take out the big wad of cash. A girl with her own don't care about your big wad of cash. That is why you have people with cards now. She take out her Scotia card, or she take out her NCB card, or she take out her Sajiko card, or she take out her Jane card. But she take out her card and she swipe her card. All if a two grand up on it, she swipe it and take her five hundred dollar fight. Just to make you know, say, you know more than her with your wad of cash. Because remember, you know, everybody needs money, but it's who you need money from. A lot of girls need money, but they don't willing to work for the money. They want the easy way out. You understand? And I know that women have power. But some women don't know them power. I should say that all women are queens, but they don't know how to wear them crown. Some of them don't put on the crown yet either. Me is a man who have respect, you know. And... Not because I have daughter. Me always love woman. I may always respect woman. I always respect my granny. Or me see my granny do or something. Me that my great granny before she did. So I grew up around woman, you know? I grew up in a big yard, but I grew up my great granny, I grew up my granny and my mother. And you know me have my uncle. And thing. Some of these women, like for instance, the narrative of a change. Woman need to stop dipping for man only and solely. Get your bag, have your bag, and a guy contribute to your bag. See, any man where watch where you have and don't feel like him to add to where you have is not a good man. That's why I always ball out and tell the girl them to stop take worthless khaki. Because when you take worthless khaki, it come like say, I just worthless, you worthless. Because remember, you know, after sex finish, what happened after sex? We still are here, said the boy can fuck. We still are here, said the, oh, the boy would big. We still are here, all of that. But when last a big would pay one of your bills, them girl? When last a good fuck pay one of your bills, them? Like, some things that the girl them do with them mouth right now and dead still two days after them, them just know, say, I just see feeling in them boom boom them off. Does the feeling alone got them and say, yo, the boy fuck out them all, oh, them all, oh, God, lad. And it laugh about and talk about, but everybody happy about the fuck until them light about to cut off. Till them phone bill about to cut off. Mm -hmm. Till them internet about to cut off. Till they learn Joe and them now nobody for call. The same man with them dash out them short gate. And dash out them mouth and every hole on them body. 
And yet still, yet still, I wonder where they mother get it from, who them can link. See? Remember, you have a whole heap of women who have struggled. Some of them have struggled because them things say them can't do better. So them feel like say by giving a man a fuck will change them life. Maybe no, I don't, maybe I don't own this pan, pan page right now, you know. I'm speaking about in general about some woman where them find themselves having three kids. And them have three kids, three kids, they must struggle. Because I see it on the internet, I see it. Sometimes I talk about it, sometimes I not talk. A girl have three pit me and she not have no bed. So she come on and she reach out to pink wall and when she reach out to pink wall she has said I need help assistance with a bed. You know me the single mom who is struggling. Every time I see something like that, my bex, my bex you fuck. Because me understand that sometimes you have one pitney and you try to fuck with feed that one pitney there because a man say me like you and him want like a pussy and him say I give you two grand or you know I give you three grand or whatever I give you. So you know busy about having protected sex, you know if you think about um, contraceptive, you know think about condom, you just say you just want to fuck and get the money, you just want to fuck and get it over with. See? So when you go to a man fuck and a try get it over with, you get caught again with the next one. Enough time you see some girl with all five pit and fuck them and fuck for feed the first one or the first two, you know. You know what I mean? Lee Fatty, where you call bro? Where you bro? I look like you bro. I'm not like you. I went in my turn bro. I hate you. See? So when I go to my mom, I see them something. Me, me understand. Don't think me understand. Me not understand. You know. Don't think me don't understand. I understand very much that sometimes some people just sit down, them get up and them look around them and them say, nothing now go on. But where you live, you see where you live should not determine where you will end up in life. Me born a jungle, you know. And through me born a jungle, me never did I go say a jungle I go be my last address. I wanted to see the world. Some people too shallow minded. Some people too what they would call it. Them them, them think one way too much, like them they on one dimension. Seen and me realize enough people like I saw them always think like me tired for ear. Why not nag one? Not nag one. You know what I mean? Like here when you call somebody and say, What's up? Or you see somebody, them I go so say, say to you, say, Me there, you look for you the better one. How the fuck me are the better one? True, me have ambition. So, true, me have ambition. Me are the better one. Me never stop you from have ambition. All that we born with ambition, and we you know, want to grow with ambition. The world that we born with ambition, and things supposed to motivate we, things supposed to influence we. So if me see a man I go work, it's supposed to influence me if I go work. If me see a man a thief, if me want to go thief, it influence me if I go thief. So we choose what we want to do. You have some people sit down, and them just say, eh, rich of them, all right, you know. Them are the better one, you know, them are right. So, when always we choose the better one. Oh, me are the better one. Because I get up and go work, you know. Me not sit down and say, I have auntie a foreign and I have uncle a foreign. Me not sit down and say them something there. You know where I grow with? Mother of, father of, sister of, brother of. Blessed is the child that have his own. At that the youth them not grow with now. Them are grow with too much blood clot bad mind. Them are grow with too much. Where they call it? Feel like them privilege. Them are grow and feel like say your things that feed them on. That's why you have so much batty guy about and too much less big girl. 
because everybody feel like say your things are for them own. Them not grow. When me when me a grow, you know me a grow with them. Be your wants. No big people things, and no borrow people things. Stay in your lane. That's something the name stay in your lane. Enough people don't understand what it mean. They don't understand what it mean. We need to get back to the days. That's why I say everybody with a child. If you have a son or a daughter or son and daughters, sit with them and have these dialogues with them. Have dialogues with your children and tell them. Not because you see somebody with something you feel like you must have it also. You're not entitled. You must not teach your pitney them to borrow people things. Tell them say, that them nothing do first. Not borrow. But you know, I remember you can't live in a big yard and grow good. Remember when you live in a big yard, and when I say big yard, meaning tenement yard. Not for us growing tenement yard. I didn't grow in a tenement yard, but I see how tenement yard go. When I live in a tenement yard, everybody in that yard, you know who dirty from who clean. You know where everybody are cook when you live in a tenement yard because everybody use the one bathroom, the one shower, and the one toilet. The toilet over the sun, the shower over the sun. Zing, build it up. Four zing put around it. And one pan the top. You know what I mean? When washing a one, everybody I use one pipe. Tenement yard, it bring unity and it bring contention. You know what I mean? People in a tenement yard fight over close pin, them fight over line space, them fight over this, them fight over everything. You understand? When you live in a tenement yard, you know who to clean the bathroom because everybody are being in the same bathroom and some of have five and six pitney. You know what I mean? So six people are bathing in one bathroom. So every week the bathroom be clean because the bathroom be stay clean because everybody are bathing there. You know what I mean? But enough of these people feel like they are too entitled. Enough of these people feel like they are too entitled and that they not like. Nobody owes nobody nothing. All if me and your brother and sister Enough of these people here and them we all go to school. Remember them choose to fuck and breed. Them choose to have 12 baby mother. And you go to and you hold it and them cars cost you every day. Cost you every day and I talk about how you know, you have you have iron balls, you have this, you have that. You depend on the nah fuck chuck, them talk everything about you. And you hold your one and you use a little small pea brain. And you're gonna make better of yourself. All of a sudden, the same man we have the 12 baby mother, he wants a spliff from you. He wants a beer from you. He wants a Guinness from you. No, a special them want. Why go and buy me a special no man? Why me a move some man? Buy me this no man and buy me that no man. And when you say no, he say you're a pussy. Pussy that you know them boy, they mean you know them not do nothing for the community. Them turn you in the council, them turn you in the MP for the community just because you have ambition. Remember, them say seven brothers, seven different minds, you know. All of we couldn't be footballer, you know. All of we couldn't be cricketer. All of we couldn't be swimmer. All of we couldn't be runner. You know what I mean? And you know who I want to big up? The people them were hustling at town for years. Them people that were come from the town days of hustling. You know how much time here some people they are town and them dying to sell something for even buy a lunch. When they hear about food, you want an arcade back. Arcade back food used to be the food one time. All Jesus go around to buy food. And we are talking about Ulmas arcade and Pernel Charles arcade. Because food seller the two arcade back them. Zin, people are try to sell a food. You know how much time people go to town and are try to even sell them bus here if you come home. Only never know how to see people down a town and why only not understand how people struggle. So that's why I tell you, say, nowadays people mentality, me don't know where them get it from. I don't know. But cable and they tell you, you know. Say cable I go fuck way up, you know. And from 1990 something cable and I tell you, say we're gone in the cable, you know. We get so caught up in the cable, you know. The smartphone we have turned we in a big dunce, you know. Because we phone smarter than we, you know. And we not try to learn nothing, you know. All we busy looking for is what spice post, you know. 
A West Spice post now, West Spice and the Rasta are going with. West Shensi are going with. West Jada Kingdom are going with. We not worry about ourselves, we are worried about other people. We get so caught up in the internet that's remember everything come on, on the internet, you know. Enough knowledge depends on the internet, like all me. Me is a man full of whole heap of knowledge. I'm going to try to share it with everybody who I can share it with. But some people are going to have my page as boring because I not talk about the regular mix up where everybody has black boat and I talk about. I'm not talking about that because I choose not to. I rather come and come talk about myself. I start to have the conversation upon this by talking about self esteem. I have a high self esteem. See? I have a high self-esteem and a lot of people have low self-esteem. Let me tell you about low self-esteem and a lot of people can relate. A low self-esteem person, if you tell them, say them don't look good, them go home, go ball. Them becks and say, Jesus Christ. Then oh, run and love you tell me, say, me don't look good. Then oh Paul if you tell me say me no look good. Jesus Christ, me nah bother go nowhere. Me nah bother go nowhere cause Sherry tell me say me no stay good. And people worry about that. That is a low self esteem person, you know. A low self esteem person put on them clothes, and when them put on them clothes, I hope nobody no say nothing, you know. Cause me we just go in and nobody come out, you know. Then I saw. Uno still in that something from one little because this is instilled enough for the parents them cause it too. Enough for the parents them cause enough for these things. Enough parents sit down and them tell the people, your dirty ugliest thing, you come like your dirty stinking father. And them tell the little girl who are underneath big. And them tell her woman I go fuck her and breed her and this and that and she go with and them tell her uh, them own daughter, them tell this, you know. Them own daughter. Y'all need to remind your daughters and sons how valuable they are to the world. You need to tell your son that he's a prince growing into a king. You need to tell your daughter she's a princess and she will be a queen one day and she must value herself. Some of you need to stop telling the daughter to use what she have and stop telling the son to use what they have too. You don't need to stop telling you them that because I realize you know. No for no mother. She wanna fuck out and you don't never get to achieve certain things because you don't feel like say you don't pussy that you care in a certain place. Some of you end up with all seven people. And you don't never believe in education. And just because you didn't believe in education, the little girl come and she have ambition and she wants to study because she aspire to be the best. She sit down and aspire to be the best. Only never help her with her homework one day yet. Only does not say only tell her go to school. Come Baba Alicia. Come Labalu. Go on to school. All who no busy about sit down in pan on the phone and I worry about other girl life. I don't like that blood clot girl. She never look good yet. And that one depends on the place and I worry about. And I don't worry about on the daughter well being. Mommy, I'm hungry. When the little girl says, Mommy, I'm hungry, you know, come near me. Where me forget it from? And are the first words that come out on the mouth. When I start telling her about any, any own year, so she, she a fuck. What I'm going to do? I'm going to put pepper in her pussy. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. All of this, I'm going say right now. If that little girl decides that she has to dash out, you can't stop it. You could have beat her till God come. You did get beat and it never changed you. You know what I mean? Again, check some of the party pics with these little girls. Little four year old in a belly skin, weaving her hair, body rider shorts. So much predators are around now. So many predators are around now. Only not see and know who not, who not live around. Because only live amongst them for years and only not know say them are pride for only look a picnic and I say blood clean look on Baba Lucia. 
Baba Lucia look good you know can't wait for she start us breasts you know right I something we bun me who not try for the little girl just like or who not dress her like a little child who not dress her for look just like uno who not batija out the door and the little five year old batija out the door so who not thinks anybody not look and then when things happen, you don't wonder why it happened or how it happened and it shouldn't happen. How do you cause it? Let the children learn to be a child. Stop rush them for grow. Make them grow. Leave the little kids, make them grow. Make them be a child. Let your son be a little baby. Don't bother rush him. Make your daughter be a little baby. Don't bother rush her. And then when you're ready, you're not talk about children. Live what them learn. When you chastise other people, pick me and when you look for what you do to phone up one daughter. When I say have dialogues with your children, you know? having dialogues with your children is a big thing. Dialogues meaning sit down and have converse with your child. How was school today? What's going on? Are you okay? You feel comfortable with your living condition? How is your room what you're living in or you understand? Una come force the pity them for love, man. When a man won't no take, when I force the picnic for love, the man won't no take. Right? Because when I look, man, some man a dirty blood clot, girl. A man don't want in a house for sleep, you know. And when you hear me cuss that blood clot there a while ago, that me realize enough for what I do, you know. When you want a man for sleep, you know. When you just want to know a man in a house for sleep, when you not even business if you're my body, man. When you not even care, when you not business, when you just want to know a man asleep in a house. One never be if the man want to bed now, nothing just no say me in the house asleep. Because you don't want to tell people, say, oh, my man, there me yard. Big up my man, big up the boy in my bed. Big up the boy in my bed. I'm going to look after the boy dinner right now. What about looking after Baba Lucia and Cynthia and Alfred dinner? Why? I don't hear about that. I'm going to look out for my kids' dinner. So I'm going to take out every blood clot strength out of nobody to take care of a man with every blood clot. Care if you don't want death for hungry. The man never asks you one day yet if you don't all right. Never yet. You don't just push up and push up. You don't know when you don't push up in people. Work off of energy. If you have somebody, energy now kick. Remember, you know, a lot of you know. All you have with a person is a sexual connection. You don't have nothing else. Nothing else you don't have. All you have is a sexual connection. I can't have a sexual connection with a girl back road. Because you can't have sex with somebody and you don't love them. So the people must sell front and back road. Nobody have no connection with them. I just stiff you with stiff because you want frock. You want broke. Once you broke, Fuck, pay, and have a good day. And if you come back tomorrow, we do it again. But me and you not in a relationship now. Now that no found off. And that no found off, you know. I don't know how to lie. On the back, when I talk, but at the truth, enough man have the same thing. So nobody be for a woman alone. This is not a one-sided thing. It's a two-sided thing. A man can have sex with even a drunk crow. Cause he would stiff up for drunk crow. Don't you hear them say man fuck anything? He would stiff on him and fuck. Him no want a responsibility. Him no want nobody a call him. Nobody business about him. Nobody care about him. Him no want none of them something there. But enough people now look on it that way. And then, two enough people now give themselves time. Them just move from one man to one man. Because they must say, as one man gone and next one come and all of that, they don't give themselves time. So I want to have 40 and 50, I want to still search. I don't want to search for. Search yourself first before you try to search for somebody else.